done at Southwark. David Southern Carrick Park. has been handed life sentences today. I'm truly humbled by the bravery of the victims. Each one was prepared to live their horrendous ordeal and face Carrick in court. I would also like to thank this the Crown Charlie Prosecution Hall. team at Thames Chiltern. We've worked side by side with the exceptional team of lawyers since October 2021, building a strong and compelling case. Our investigation does not stop here, however, and we've set up a special reporting portal to allow people to continue to share information with us. This portal will remain open and details can be found on the Hertfordshire Police website. I would urge anyone who thinks they've been a victim of David Carrick to come forward. We still want to hear from you and we will support you. As a serving police officer, David Carrick has brought shame on the profession and was not fit to wear the uniform. But I hope that our determination to get justice for the victims in this case will go some way to reassuring the public that nobody is above the law and we will, we will bring people like David Carrick to justice. Today is about recognising the outstanding bravery of the victims. It often takes courage for anyone to come forward and report a rape, but in this case, to overcome the mental and physical oppression they endured may have felt insurmountable at times. We've heard the accounts of women who suffered at Carrick's hands. He took away their control, their right to choose, their freedom, in some cases both physically and mentally. We cannot undo the pain and anguish that they have endured, but I hope that they can take this first step in rebuilding their lives knowing that he can't harm them or any other woman. We are so grateful to every woman who has come forward and supported this case. With each report that came in, we had a clearer picture of who Carrick was and what he had done. The similarities between the victim accounts detailing mental and physical torment at the hands of the same man were our case. We would not be where we are today without you, the victims, taking that step forward and providing us with the vital evidence needed to prosecute Carrick. With your help, the Crown Prosecution Service worked with the investigation team at Hertfordshire Constabulary to build such a strong case that Carrick had no choice but to plead guilty. We know there are victims of other rape and serious sexual offences out there and that many of you may be worried about being believed or whether you will ever see justice done. We understand these concerns and want to reassure you that we are doing everything that we can to improve how these offences are handled and we are determined to see justice done for more victims of violence against women and girls. We hope seeing Carrick, a prolific abuser, manipulator and rapist behind bars, will encourage other women to come forward, knowing we will do all we can to hold the person responsible to account for their crime. Thank you.